If you would like to book a personal tarot reading with me, I offer same-day personal tarot card readings for $20. You receive your reading the same day of your purchase. Everything you need to know of details is in the description box below of this video of how to book with me. Thank you so much. Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel and thank you for being here and for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val 3 Tarot and with Spirit and we're just going to jump right in here and see what does Spirit want to tell you the most today in regards to your current situation of who you're dealing with. What are their true thoughts and feelings and intentions towards you? Now, keep in mind, this is for Aquariuses who are single. And this is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, in the North Node. So it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. And I do offer same-day personal readings for $20. And I have another tarot channel at Val444 Tarot. And a vlog channel at Val Smib. Um, everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you, Aquarius. Aquarius looks like here that right now they're just basically waiting they're waiting on some stuff planning you know uh figuring some things out okay waiting on you waiting on whatever's going on in life here being patient okay so it looks like here that this could be a friend okay a friend where there could be more going on with the two of you now either well you're the one who's single so it looks like here that they could be someone that's in a relationship or a marriage but they're also starting to get involved with you i'm kind of getting you know maybe polyamorous kind of energy but you're more on the single you know the single part single vibe they could be more open um, for some of you here there's something going on where like i said friend groups the thing is is for this person they're not really sure if they want to do this anymore with you or feel happy or celebrated. They don't, like something's starting to get a little weird and off. They're not able to trust you right now, but they're also not being trustworthy. Now, for some of you that could be planning to spend time with you and hang out with you. Yeah, okay, they're very unhappy and unfulfilled with you right now they're kind of like saying that whatever's going on with the two of you it's not it but the thing that's interesting is they really want something out of you really bad though at the same time but i don't know what that could be yeah looks like they're going to continue lying to you about what's going on here so they're lying to themselves though too and to you and to other people because I kind of get the sense this is someone that's extremely in denial that they have this like weird open polyamorous relationship with you but you're the one who's still single but they still have who they have and it's getting complicating it's getting weird they don't know what to do what, what how to trust or who to trust they're not really being too trustworthy either and but they're not truly fulfilled and happy with themselves nor are they with you and so they aren't ready to face some serious stuff they're definitely in denial about whatever is going on with the two of you here and not wanting to own up and be honest yeah they're not happy they do not want to give you a message of love they're not being loving they're not happy or excited right now things are feeling like a mess for this person right now they're very annoyed with you i don't know why unless they're watching this and they resonate with it and they're mad that you're asking about them yeah, because I know they're not being themselves, they're not being real. Okay, so I'm getting, I, I just heard in my head, like in the closet. So they could be, you know, a lesbian or a gay man. Um, and they're not, they can't be, I guess, if that makes sense. They can't be open quite yet. Um, they're emotionally battling that and fighting that with themselves. It's not for all of you who you're dealing with, but for some of you, I do... I know I can see it in the cards that I don't kind of can't explain how or why I don't teach tarot. Um, it's very specific though. It's just once in a blue moon. 
So yeah, they're not really feeling emotionally too successful anymore of how to approach or what to do. They're stuck. They know they're not being truly authentic with you and with other people. Okay, but see, here's the thing. They are in love with you. They have love for you though. So maybe this is what they want. They want it to come out. They literally want to come out of <laughs> the closet maybe. I don't know. Um, okay, they do want a new beginning with you. So they are in love with you. They do love you. They do like you. They want something here with you. Oh, crap. Okay, two, th two things here. One, if they are in a relationship with someone else, but they're dealing with you, I think they're finally going to just be single and break up and be done with that person and then maybe pursue you. If not, what they're saying is they're absolutely done with you. Like what makes them happy is to just drop it and be done with you and not even bother with you. So either or. I mean, they are, sorry, I'm, of course, like distractions. <laughs> Something randomly is tickling my nose. Very witchy. <clears throat> Maybe they're a witch or you're a witch. I don't know. Who cares? Um, it looks like here, yeah. They are healing, though. That's the thing. They are doing the right thing, though, with healing and releasing and, like, figuring out some things here. So, okay. They could be messaging you and researching and studying what's going on here. Okay, they're healing and researching themselves <clears throat> and you. <coughs> okay, that's weird. <coughs> okay. Okay. Hmm. So all that research and study and them kind of doing that inner work all of a sudden has gotten them to get to this point where... Mm, now they're kind of more annoyed and upset about like their own career path, job, money, business, finances, something about how they can't get it out of you anymore, get enough out of you. It's like they're financially dependent on you. Excuse me, somehow. They're kind of in that greedy mentality though, because they have more than enough, but they're not really willing to try that hard either. But they want more, but they don't really want to put in the work. Oh, okay. Well, first, I see what's going on. Uh-oh. So, let's just say, you, obviously, you're single. So, who they're dealing with, I think, just entered the chat and is really pissed off that this is actually real and coming out. Because they're very confident with you and still feeling passionate and they feel good. Despite that they're, you know, I don't know, um just a workaholic and obsessed with you know more money material greed wealth whatever they're trying to find a way to get that out of you which does make them feel confident but i think who they're in a relationship with is who's pissed off now and doesn't want to do anything because they know what's going on with the two of you okay you could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. That's what I have for you. Wait right that. there before you click off. First of all, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that this helped you. Don't forget that I offer same-day personal tarot readings for $20. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. And by the way, for more tarot readings, if you'd like, please check out my husband's tarot channel at Possessed777. I have a bonus tarot channel for the general collective at Val444 Tarot. And if you want to check out my vlog channel where it's about our personal life, you'll see a lot of my husband there as well at Val Smib. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. Thank you so much. Bye.